Okay, let's have a little butchers. Uh, Netherlands versus Turkey. Netherlands at minus 167. You'd think that this is a Netherlands to win, both teams to score. Turkey are a minus 165 to score, and they're plus 459 to, to basically win and get themselves in the semi final. Over two and a half goals at minus 130. You'd think that was a way to go. Netherlands. Score twice, Alex, at minus one forty-eight. You've got to say Netherlands are massive favourites, but Turkey, they're going to have a, they're going to have another, another. Fans are going to be off the charts, inside and outside. This is their final. It, it is, it is their final, uh, and uh, Turkey was absolutely brilliant uh, against Austria. They had a great, uh, uh, they played amazing, and I think that. Um, can you hear? Can you still hear me? I can hear you. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Because I don't see anyone. <laughs> no, here, no, so. no, no. It's just the uh, just the producers just getting the best numbers. He's like he's like <clears throat> monitoring them. He loves the numbers. Um, it's really difficult to to uh, uh, to make a decision on this game because I really think that Turkey right now at plus five hundred are overpriced plus 450 plus 500 are a bit overpriced i was looking even at plus one on the asian handicap at uh, minus 120 is there also a way to go uh, i don't think that the netherlands if they win they win by more than one goal i think that we will have a lot of goals in this match with turkey scoring also so why not why not go with over one goal in the first half at minus 120 yeah, I, I also like Netherlands to win. I think that they will win this game because they've got too much. But I think maybe both teams score as well. So you go both teams to score and over and have, don't care who wins. Or you go Netherlands to win and Turkey um, to, to basically both teams to score. Let's try and break it down a little bit because obviously Cody Gakpo is uh, taking... Listen, what he had five shots yesterday and scored yeah. and, and had other chances. Uh, Memphis Depay... They are creating. They are creating. They've got so many players that they play with their food, though. Because I Javis tell you now, Simmons, if it's one. Yeah, Javi Simmons for me Marlin. is running into the wrong errors, and they don't, they don't pass the ball quick enough to kill teams off. It was one nil in the uh, the round of sixteen game, and it could have been one one, and all of a sudden they're fighting, and they they went up with three nil. Yes, what I think, yeah, but it was it was mistake. So the second goal of the Netherlands against uh, Romania was a mistake from uh, Dragushin, uh, yeah. the Tottenham def defender. W huge mistake. And the third goal came in the last minute of the game when Romania wanted to score exactly. the uh, yeah the one goal. And it was uh, they they had all eleven players uh, there in the box for a free kick or whatever. And of course Daniel Malen. Uh, who is a counter-attack uh, player, went alone and uh, scored the third goal. Uh, but um, they had a lot of shots. Uh, Romanian's goalkeeper uh, was amazing, even though the first goal was a bit his mistake. But again, also Turkey has a brilliant uh, goalkeeper and he showed that against uh, Austria, right? And uh, uh, weirdly, strangely or not, all the free goals in that Austria-Turkey game they came from corners. That yeah. tells you that uh, Turkey are dangerous uh, for on set pieces, right? And the Netherlands without Van Dijk there uh, uh, are not that uh, how it, strong, at the, strong at the back. So this is why I think that also Turkey can can find the back of the net. Yeah, it's a it's a 2-1 game in my opinion for the Netherlands. But you are brave enough to take because the Turks will fight for their life. This is what they will show. 90% of the crowd the are going to be soul. driving them on. And how many people, how many Turks uh, are in uh, in Germany, right? Three and a half million. The, 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 the fans will be uh, absolutely going crazy in the stands for Turkey. Mm. So this is um, also the also the orange orange wall for for the Netherlands created yeah. a nice show against Romania. So the atmosphere will be electric once again. It will be a game with goals, in my opinion. Yeah, and it's also got to be a lineup check because uh, that's why I've not gone with. Ah, also Chakanoglu. Because... Chakanoglu is back from suspension because. Yeah, was, that's massive. He's, the, he's their flag bearer Huge. and their captain. But I mean, so you're saying that Van Dyke is out uh, because uh, on Turkey has two players suspended, uh, Koku and Yuksik. So again, you've got to have a little look and see who actually comes in here because Turkey had like 75 yellows yesterday. Um, 
again. No, because I, 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 I think that from the quarterfinals they raised them. I, I, I don't remember exactly, but I don't okay. see in the, I don't see no from one the quarterfinals. This is the quarterfinals. Yeah, uh, from the quarterfinals. Yeah, so it's after no. this game, isn't it? It's after this, so they don't mm -hmm. miss the semis. I, I don't see no one out uh, for, for this match. Oh, okay. Uh, well, uh, Ian says Turkey has two players suspended. Okay, so again... No, no, sure no. You no. Do, do you. Chahanoglu and the other one uh, got suspended for Austria. Now they are back. Mm. Yeah, but now look. Koku and uh, Yuksik, they're out for the next game. Really? Yeah. Let me check. Yeah, I know. I mean, it's, uh, I tell you what you've done. You've gone to that dodgy Bundesliga uh, website that we used to get last year when they used to say that players were playing and they'd left the country three years ago. Um, yeah, listen, it's one of those. Oh, I, I've got to speak about um, uh, Kwaku's uh, selection here because he has actually gone for the whole, uh, Netherlands to win yeah, and yeah, both teams to he's, score. He's right, uh, Ayan. He's right about Koku uh, or Kun Koku. Uh, quarterfinals through suspension. We'll miss the quarterfinals through suspension. Uh, okay, that and and that is the only one. And what about the Netherlands? Because Who are they missing? Are they missing anyone? No one. No. So you've got to be thinking the Netherlands at minus one sixty-seven could be a parlay piece. Uh, okay, I do think that Netherlands win, but they can do better. Get that second goal because I'm telling you now against Romania, they won three 0 but when it, it could have been seven, but uh, for long stages, it was one. And if you play with your food and then end up 1-1, one, one, then it's all up for grabs. Uh, Bob says, France defence wins championships. And let's hope you're right. Let's have a little look at the official picks. Oh, only only Kwaku has a pick in this uh, at the moment because obviously we want, we want to check the lineup. So he's gone. Uh, what price is that, please, uh, producer? Just tell me. Plus 240. I quite like this, talking to the old uh, producer. Uh, so, Quaker's gone with Netherlands to win and both teams to score at plus 240. Now